it is your responsibility to care for your exit site. You will be shown steps for doing exit site care before leaving the hospital. It is very important to follow these steps and use good hand washing technique in order to keep your exit site clean and free from infection. If you notice any signs of infection, such as redness, tenderness, swelling, drainage, bleeding, or a bad smell, call your VAD coordinator or hospital contact person right away. Treating infections early is very important. One method for performing exit site care is using a dressing change kit. We'll demonstrate it for you. To begin, the person doing the dressing change should put on a hair cover and mask, then wash their hands thoroughly. Open all of the items that are needed and place them on a clean surface. Put on the non-sterile gloves and remove the outer dressing while holding the driveline in place to prevent tugging on the exit site. An alcohol prep pad may be used to help remove any remaining adhesive. Now, remove the old gauze or silver pad. Then, slowly peel the immobilizing device from the skin. Then take off the non-sterile gloves and discard them. Next, Unwrap the tray, touching only the corners of the blue wrap to keep the inner content sterile. Wash your hands again, or use hand sanitizer, and then put on the sterile gloves. Using the Chlora Scrub Swab Stick, clean the skin around the exit site in a circular motion, starting at the driveline and moving away from the exit site. Then use another swab, or a sterile Chlora Scrub Wipe, as shown here, to clean the driveline close to the exit site. Next, apply a new dressing. If using a silver pad, wet it with sterile saline and then place the pad around the driveline with the gray side down and in direct contact with the skin at the exit site. For patients with sensitive skin, a barrier film pad may be used to wipe the area where the dressing and anchor adhesives make contact with the skin. Next, apply the clear dressing, centering it over the silver pad and smoothing it down so that it sticks to the skin. Check the entire dressing, making sure it is completely stuck to the skin. At this point, immobilize the driveline using a stabilization device such as the Centurion Foley Anchor as shown here. Position it under the driveline at the desired location and apply it to the skin. Then, position the driveline across the anchor. After applying the anchor, wait about 20 minutes before performing any strenuous activity so that the anchor can become fully adhered to your skin.